Hello guys, I'm Chef Lorius. Welcome back to my love lab. This is Calabama Cooking. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Today we are making my ooey gooey chocolate caramel brownie. This is one of those super rich, super decadent desserts. If you're on a diet, just ignore it right now because this is so good. You find a reason, find a reason that it's okay for you to eat this. <laughs> All right guys, let's jump right in. This is one of my faves. Okay guys, let's get started with our basic ingredients. We're gonna start by melting a stick of butter and a cup of semi-sweet chocolate chips, okay? We're gonna melt these together in the microwave. You can do it over the stove, I'm gonna do it in the microwave, okay? The rest of the ingredients. We have our caramel chips because we're making these caramel chocolate brownies, right? And then we're gonna have some all-purpose flour and some sugar, okay? We're also gonna have some eggs, and some baking powder and salt, and then some instant coffee and some vanilla flavoring. Let's jump right in. Let's get to it. Okay guys, I have melted my chocolate, see that? I did it in 30 second bursts in the microwave and just stirred it in between until it was completely ready. Now we're going to let this cool while we mix the rest of our ingredients, okay? So here in this bowl, I'm going to add my eggs, and my sugar, okay, my vanilla, and my coffee. I'm going to stir these together. I'm not gonna over whip them because I don't want them to get too airy. I actually want these brownies, you know, to have a, a, a kind of a gooiness to them. So I don't want a ton of air, but I just wanna combine this really well, okay? There we go. See, just, just combined. Now that this is combined, I'm gonna go back to my chocolate mixture here, which is just cooled down just a little bit, and I'm gonna add it in a little bit at a time. Combining, oh, it smells good. Smells like brownies already. See, by letting this chocolate cool just a little bit, I'm not gonna cook my eggs. Let me get another spoon here. Get all this good chocolate out. The hardest part for me right now is not licking the bowl with just the chocolate and the butter. <laughs> I know I'm not alone in that. There we go. Okay. Oh, just a little more. See, if I leave any in, in the bowl, it's gonna land on my waistline. <laughs> then I'm gonna mix this together, see? See how I'm not over mixing it? It's, I'm well combining it, but I'm not over mixing it, okay? Then I'm gonna take my flour and baking powder, which I've combined here, and I'm gonna put them here and basically kind of sift them in there, okay? Just like that. Oh, this is looking good already. I can't wait to eat these. <laughs> you know, I cook what I wanna eat, usually, and I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, guys. <laughs> okay, see how I'm just mixing this in, just kind of combining it? The flour is what's going to give it structure and kind of let it hold together so that it's not just a big molten mess. Okay, we want molten, but we don't want a molten mess. Now, to make this caramel, I'm going to take this half a cup here of caramel chips I have. And to these caramel chips, I'm going to add about a tablespoon of flour. Okay, just about a tablespoon of flour, and I'm gonna stir them. Now what this flour is gonna do is prevent these chips from sinking to the bottom when I combine them into the mixture here, okay? See, just wanna coat them with it, okay? And then I'm just gonna take them, I could dump the whole thing in, but I don't wanna get all the excess flour, I just wanna get a little bit of the, just really get the, the chips in there. I love caramel, I love chocolate, I love car. well, let me back up, I love caramel. I like chocolate, but if you put caramel in chocolate, I love chocolate. I love chocolate caramel, that's what it is. All right, so you're gonna get those in there and then just stir to incorporate that. See, just a little bit. Let me get a few more. <laughs> this is gonna be delicious, guys, <laughs> I'm sorry. You know when you're making a dish and you have, it's coming together and you can tell already that it's just gonna be right that's this dish, it's just gonna be right. I'm gonna put these in cast iron. Can you see that, guys? See that? There we go. All right, guys, here is our brownie fresh out of the oven. I ended up putting everything in one skillet. I decided not to do two. So it just 
Oh my God, it looks delicious. I'm gonna get a bowl and get some ice cream out so we can get ready to just get into it. <laughs> All right, guys, I got my bowl ready. Now, the beauty of this brownie is it's ooey gooey. All right, I keep saying that. We're gonna cut into it. You can just spoon serve it, see? Oh, look at that. Can you guys see that gooey still in there? Oh my goodness, this looks delicious. We're gonna take it out just like so. You can continue cooking this if you like, but I am going for the ooey gooey. I'm gonna get a little bit more here. Oh yes. It's kind of almost like a lava cake. You know what I'm saying? It's almost got that lava cake consistency to it. Let me get this ice cream here. Oh, there. And when you get the ice cream with it, it just starts to melt right away. You see that? I'm supposed to be dieting this week, but I'm doing this for you guys, family. Okay, I'm going in. Can you see that? Can you see it? Do you smell it? Oh my word. And I've got the, oh. <laughs> mm. This has me speechless. The caramel with the richness of the brownie. Like I said, if you don't want ooey gooey, keep baking it. I like ooey gooey with the ice cream melting. Hold on. Let me get one more. Look, you see, I got the ice cream. You see, I got the ooey gooey. Mmm. Okay. I think I just blew my diet this week, but it was so worth it. Oh my word. All right, guys, thank you for joining me today. I hope you make this brownie. It is unbelievable. I probably shouldn't even call it a brownie. It's more of a ooey gooey chocolatey goodness thing. Whatever. Have a great day. Thanks for joining me. I'll see you next time right here in the Love Lab for more Calabama cooking with Chef Lori's. Have a great day. Happy cooking. Hey guys, Chef Lori is here. Thanks so much for stopping by my channel. If you like these kinds of step-by-step -step instructions, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. There's so much here, you'll never get bored. Also be sure to visit my website, cheflorius.com for printable recipes and follow me on social media, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, you name it, I'm there. Have a great day, happy cooking.